Hey guys, I'm gonna zoom in on this, but there's a woman with a bird stuck in her hair. She's like, <laughs> someone help me. There's don't act natural. There's a it's, bird. Well, she's not moving in at all. That's for sure. Hair. Someone get this bird out of my hair before I lose my shit. <laughs> guys, we're here. Say, so, okay, so we just beat the mirror challenge because, and there was never a shred of doubt in my mind that I could oh, do sure. it. Oh, sure. I knew from the beginning that I was going to be able to do yeah, it. Yeah, right. Um, you did the impossible according to the referee. Yeah. I'm like, um, um, someone who did impossible things. <laughs> I can't think of anything. <laughs> anyway, it doesn't matter. That I'm like sad. a cool. Uh, that was There's not a sad. box up there. Don't forget it. I get want it. it. I know, but these guys are so talky talky. Uh, this is not about talking. This is about coromoning. About fighting. Uh, over you beating it's a cube. Coromoning. Okay. I came up with the term. Coromoning. Guys, the Pokemon game comes out in a month. A little over a month. Yeah, we'll most likely do a Let's Play, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You oh, pre ordered it, no? Yes, I did. Yeah, of course you did. Turkey, there you are. Dumb question. <laughs> of course. Um, yeah, that, that one I'm excited to play. We believe we're closing in on Thomas. That's why I'd like to give you a certain something which can speed up your travels. Is this going to be the surf module? I just, uh, just give me a moment. All right, you got a moment. <clears throat> it's passed. All right, I'm waiting. What's going on here? Hold on, you found that Lumon? Torky, keep your distance. This is a very delicate specimen. Oh, oh it's the dark magic ones. Those guys are too a close, little tough. Too close, too close. You must remember the chaos that Lumon caused when roused. Ooh, he gets into trouble when he's aroused, George. Ooh, who That's hasn't? That's a special <laughs> Lumon right there. Yeah, who doesn't get into trouble when aroused? <laughs> Has it caused any more troubles as you captured it? Yes, that thing can teleport other people. It's been placing us all over the room. <laughs> and the Lumon can like perfectly fun. mimic any Coromon it lays eyes on, a temporary metamorphosis. Oh. Uh, I think I've seen something like that recently. It took, quite, oh, it took quite a lot of manpower to sedate it, so we've only been able to observe this creature for a short amount of time. Oh, this is Roseanne. Why am I reading it like this? But the strangest <laughs> thing we observed so far... <clears throat> excuse me. Is that it doesn't seem to breathe. You can read it any way you want. It doesn't matter, right? <laughs> like, not at all yet. Its final signs show that it's alive. It's alive. There's still so much to learn about this mutated species, this different type of Coromon. Torky, of course you wanted to look at the Lumon. You were the one who fought it, after all. The unique type we detect this Coromon be the lead we're looking for in regards to Thomas. Yeah, so that's the whole thing about this game is the dark, I think dark magic they're called, or just dark Coromon, uh -huh. um, which are well, strong against everything. Um, so oh, when you have to fight geez. him later, it's a pain. Oh, really? You're going to have to fight him? Uh huh. Uh, you we already had to fight for one that. way back. I don't know if you remember. It was probably months ago that we played back in the, um, in the, the Electric Island. Um, oh. We had to fight that Lumon. And he was uh, difficult, to say the least. Yeah, I think I remember now. <laughs> All right, so cool. Lux Thanks, bird. Thanks, Nigel or Rigel. We need to get going. I want to get <laughs> some water. Um, head for the Fire Essence, located deep within the volcanic volcano of Lama in the West Batavi Mountains. Lama Lama. Um, <clears throat> okay. Didn't we have to be in a volcano too and tempt him? Yeah, and in Pokemon. <laughs> Pokemon too? I, yeah, that's where all the fire types live. In the volcano. Where they else all would live a fire, in a volcano. Where else would a fire type live? In I hell. I don't know. In hell. I'll see you in, in hell. In somebody's fireplace. <laughs> <laughs> in 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 the fire pit, in, in a campfire. Yeah, a campfire. Like, there you go. They're like the toasted marshmallow Coromon. Like, oh, I'm small as the toasted marshmallow. I can melt on top of you and I'm taste sticky, delicious. I'm sticky, gooey, good. Oh, so sticky, gooey, good. All right, so should I switch out? Mm, we're going to be fighting a lot of water types, which means I need electricity. Okay, be prepared. That's This is called strats. This is called strategizing. Get my bitty bolt. Yeah, maybe this time you'll sound more confident than the last time. 
Um, look, it's not about sounding confident. It's about being confident. So it's, it's not how you sound on the outside. It's how you feel within your heart. <laughs> okay. If, if your heart tells you you're confident, then the world is your oyster and you can do what you want with it. Have you ever heard that saying, the world is your oyster? Yeah, I never understood what that's um, pertained to oyster. I, I think, yeah, here's the thing about that saying. Is that it makes no sense. <laughs> it's, right? like, like, it's like a nonsense The world thing. is your oyster. <laughs> like, I could just say, like, the when world. When you eat it. I got a phone message from Oleg. Oh, I'm so popular. Gooey, yucky. The world is your peanut butter and jelly sandwich. And you're like, the fuck you talking about? I thought it was about? like, the world is a stage. Um, Shakespeare. This, this is, yeah, that's how Shakespeare um all the world's a stage and we are all merely the world's players a stage that's what he says yeah and we are merely players that's you know why i know that Playa. line yeah do, do you know why i know that line because you went to private school <laughs> because <laughs> because i'm a shakespeare aficionado i saw shakespeare in love like 16 times in the theater when it came out and that's I was like, weird because you have no shakespeare books here <laughs> He's, he was in, so in love. It was that, um, I know who was in it. It was Julia Roberts and, <laughs> and, <laughs> and Richard Gere, Shakespeare <laughs> in Love. <laughs> uh, you're talking about Pretty Woman? Yeah, Shakespeare in Love, where <laughs> Julia Roberts Second plays a title, prostitute. Second title, Pretty Woman? <laughs> Julia Roberts plays a prostitute. <laughs> Richard Gere slams like a jewelry box closed on her hand for some reason. <laughs> Definitely. That um, was imp improvised. Was it? Yeah. I'm sure Julia Roberts loved that. <laughs> she uh, was laughing. Uh, okay. Anywho, where was, I need to go to. You need to watch the movie, George. <laughs> I need to remember where the hell I'm supposed to go. Is it on this side? Oh yeah, it's on this side. I'm lost. Where's your GPS? There's a box. There's, oh, a box. there's a box. There's a box. Oh, by the way, the scan module. By the way, I was like, what, what, what? When you do that, it shows you when there's secrets. So watch when I press it. You see how that pot up there lit up? This one here. Yeah, I'll stand next to it. You see how it got like a little sparkle? Oh, it sparkled. That means like there's a hidden something object inside game. of it. See, Mira, look at that. Yay! All these so-called archaeologists are digging for gems in their own gain, but they forget what archaeology is really about. I mean, look at this. I discovered the remains of an ancient city. Isn't that way cool. more useful for society? That still happens. <clears throat> it's neat. They discover ancient cities. Yeah, they still do. I mean, lots yeah. of stuff out there. Yeah. Yeah, they do. Um, There was someone in one of my classes that's an archaeologist. She was working in Virginia. Doing some unearthing, but not ancient cities. She said she was working on um, like more recent, like in the last 200 years, like colon, like um, early America settlements and stuff like that. Oh, that's those neat. type of. Uh, oh yeah, definitely. Like, we'll find plenty of that in Virginia. Yeah, that's what she was looking. That's cool. In, like colonies and stuff like that. Yeah, unearthing stuff from that era. Cool. Um, but there's a lot. Sounds they like found fun. like ancient stuff in America. Especially in, um, if I'm not mistaken, New Mexico or Utah. Indigenous peoples? Yeah, and then also like prehistoric mm -hmm. peoples and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. Guys, you didn't expect to learn something listening to this, but you did. <laughs> you learned vague references to stuff we heard about maybe once. <laughs> like, I think they found something in the thing somewhere. Oh, uh, no, you don't need fire. You need... <laughs> Don't burn the box. You like it when you like you half remember a fact and you try to describe it to someone. And you're you just like, try to bullshit your way through it. And you're yeah, like, I sure. probably should have just not said anything. Oh, there's an item in this cacti. Oh, oh we'll just deal with it. You just it. got <laughs> protein. <by> it. <laughs> I got poked. Oh, she liked it. <laughs> yeah. She'll tell you, she'll be like, she'll say like, oh, I didn't want it, but she's just playing hard to get. <laughs> <laughs> Such a tease. You remember when you guys would say that and now you're like, wow, you're a rapist. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> you know, when she says no and she's just playing hard to get. I, was like, I know, uh, that was a thing back then. I think she just doesn't want to have sex with you because you may be a creep. <laughs> she just doesn't want to. Uh, Maurice. Hey, you want to do the voice of Maurice? <laughs> bra, bra. It slipped my mind. My surfboard was supposed to be in my backpack. Man, I was going to hit the waters in Vimir Grotto. My buds must be having a ball. Okay, fun talking to you. Bye, bra. Bye, bra. Bra. Sounds like bra, like what I'm wearing right now. 
You're wearing a bra? I yeah, thought we were you, doing you sound this. disappointed. I thought we were doing this Let's Play Sans underwear. Are you, Commando? Of course. Yeah, right. I never wear underwear for my Let's Plays. I need to be hanging loose. <laughs> hanging that loose? <laughs> hanging loose with the with the juice in my underwear. <laughs> juice. Okay, <laughs> what's going on in there? Oh, man, you don't want to know. <laughs> Playing Coromon turns you on. Oh, my God. Oh, is he's kind of cute. <laughs> oh, At wow, lantern. he is like... Um, I'm more than double my level, so you know what? As much as I bye. love you, you can't fight him. He's too strong for you, Coquette. Oh, bye, kitty. Oh, sorry. <laughs> we need the tough guy out here. He's like the Foofy's like the enforcer. He's like Foofy's no. Foofy's like you're a not sumo wrestler, man. Look at his stance. <laughs> Have you ever seen a sumo match? No. Like on TV or anything? I've seen, well, I mean, I've seen clips, but not like the whole thing, like. Oh, you know. no? you never seen the whole? The no, have you? Have you? Jeez, no, gosh. But here's what I have seen. Um, They're butts. Well, yeah, uh, I've seen a few. <laughs> I've seen a few butts in my day. I don't want to brag, but. Okay, I've seen a weirdo. couple. I've seen a couple of butts, uh, um, <laughs> including Tommy Wiseau's in the room. I don't know if you remember, but you see his nice butt when he walks in. <laughs> when he's so having sex with that poor lady's belly button, <laughs> you can see his butt. <laughs> um, Gross. Uh, no, what was I gonna say before I was talking about butts? I forgot now. Oh, sorry. <sighs> you better. You have be a delicate sorry. brain there. Oh no, <laughs> I need to backtrack. We were talking about butts. You were asking me if I've seen a sumo match or something. Oh, sumo wrestler. I went to Japan. Did not see a sumo match. But you missed out. I, I, I feel like Probably I did. It was fun to watch. Oh my god, it would have been cool. But what I did see uh -huh. is the Jean Claude Van Damme movie, <laughs> The Quest, <laughs> which is not at all what you think that movie, a movie called The Quest, would be about. Um, <laughs> but it was an interesting movie. Uh, yeah, <laughs> it's. I wouldn't use the word good to describe it. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Interesting, interesting. But they are all on an island doing a um, Van Dam style um, tournament of uh, martial arts. And you have like arts. many people of different nationalities with their own martial arts. Like you have like uh -huh. a Italian guy that's a boxer. That's what I'm like saying. That was a, the interesting part of it. Yeah, you have like a Chinese guy who does kung fu. You have like um, someone from Thailand who does like a different style of martial arts. I don't know what they're all called, but <laughs> from <laughs> representing the country of Japan. <laughs> fighting a bunch of like martial artists is a sumo a wrestler which is an interesting choice <laughs> considering a sumo wrestling i wouldn't call it so much like martial arts but more like wrestling <laughs> where they where they're more like um well, it's still know. a fighting style i suppose I it counts it seems like an odd choice considering um that japan is the home of karate Seems like a strange choice to have a sumo wrestler. Um, it's ancient. It's traditional. So is karate. I don't know. Maybe that's older. <laughs> hey, dork. <laughs> you just splash water in my face on purpose because I got to teach you a lesson. Who's this dork. person? It's a Lars. Hey, Why is dork. he hiding? Because he's. She's hiding. They're hiding. I think it's a he. Why is everyone's level so much higher than you, cool cats? You. Well, we're getting close to like the end, right? How many Titans do we have left? Uh, three. Oh, okay, tree. we're not that close. Yeah, we have tree left. Well, actually, we well, how many do tree. we have behind us? Tree. Oh, we're halfway. Yeah. We're at the halfway point. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Now, fellas, what's cooler than being cool? <laughs> Ice cold. Hey guys, you like Outcast references for a band that hasn't been a band for like, well, I don't know, 15 years? I wouldn't years. call that a band. It's just a duo, right? Uh, I mean, Group. would you call the White Stripes a band? Because that's just two of them. It's I think they did call them a band, right? Jack White and the... His sister wife. His sister wife. <laughs> his wife, sister, sister or wife. One of the two. <laughs> we're not Both. sure. Both. They were always Both. putting that out there. I don't know. I, I think 
do they still do stuff as the white stripes or are they like strictly now um i think he's on his own he just does stuff right? on his own or I the think. racketeer he used to be in another band called the racketeers oh yeah the racketeers yeah and he was big in nash because he lived in nashville is racketeers or raccoon tears because there was a group called Raccoon. Raccoon Tours it was like French or you, something. Yeah, you know you're in a good band when no one knows how to pronounce it. <laughs> you see, they're Raccoon Tours. <laughs> <laughs> you know you picked the right oh, name. Um, that works. Oh, I burned him. Fire. No, stop splashing me. Stupid Daryl Hannah motherfucker. Splashing. I tinkle you. I tinkle you. You tinkle me? I tinkle you. I mean, maybe for a tourist gets aroused by that. Maybe he's like one of those people who's like big into having snowmen pee on him. <laughs> you know how dogs pee <laughs> on snowmen? Tinkle. You know how like dogs pee on snowmen? Do you think like a snowman's fantasy is to pee on a dog? Get peed on? <laughs> oh, the other way around. <laughs> yeah, to be like, I'll you show you. You pee me, I pee you. <laughs> we, we all pee pee each other. <laughs> like pee pee you, pee pee me. No, but um, that's one of those things like when winter comes and you get the fresh snowfall and you get this nice beautiful white blanket over everything and then like two days later there's just so many spots of yellow pee all over the snow <laughs> from all the neighborhood dogs yeah that happens you're like oh now it's like lemonade snow <laughs> yay <laughs> pina colada oh sheer tooth Oh, so many water types. I need to level up my electric types. There's a pudgy little guy. Yeah, we could have picked him at the beginning, but we didn't. We yeah. picked we picked Foofy and said, Wow, that's, that's okay. very Foofy's effective. Cool. Are you sure? It said it was very effective, but I think he's lying. All right. Kick his ass so we can wrap it up. Oh, we're done? We're done. Uh, yeah. Should I kick his ass in the next episode? No, we'll finish up this episode. This isn't gonna take too long. It'll take like two minutes because two I'm hours. No, and look, I'm so tough. He's already halfway dead. He's halfway to death. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's halfway there. He's like Bon Jovi. He's living on a prayer. If you take his hand, or he's like Aerosmith, living on the edge. Yeah, or like. It's a, oh, that reminds me of something. I'm gonna mention in the next episode. The next episode. I'll right. mention in the next episode. Okay, okay. Because I want to know your response. Well, okay, give me like a little bit of a hint. Be like, is it have. It's about music. Yeah, boom. It's about music. Yeah. Um, Something I saw on Facebook. Oh. Now I'm excited. Okay, don't make it sound like I'm, that. That was creepy. No. I'm excited. Ooh, no. I'm titillated. I'm, I'm, I'm very titillated. Stop, I'm, I'm creepo. so... My God, my tits are so <laughs> lated right now. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs>